Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how you can increase your exploration progress in areas fast. The first thing to do is your treasure compass. What how to get how do you get a treasure compass in every area? So what you have to do is to do your reputation quest so you can get a treasure compass diagram. And for Inazuma Sumeru Fontaine, you need you have to be level 9, but for Mondstadt and Liyue, you need to be level 6, which is much easier, so I recommend doing Mondstadt and Liyue first. Number 2, your, char your character of choice. So, um, for party, let me just go in the party setup, setup real quick. Elemental Resonance can also help you because you will decrease stamina consumption by 15% and increases movement speed by 10% which will make you move faster. And also, since I have Lynette and Sayu out, these two 4 stars have uh, their elemental skill that helps them to move fast, as you can see with Lynette and Sayu. I'd also like to mention some character, I mean some weapons, but not all weapons, they will um, give extra movement speed. For example, my lost prayers to the sacred winds, it will increase movement speed by 10%. And also, some characters' constellations will also increase the, the movement speed. For example, Gene C2, when Gene picks up an elemental orb, all party members have their movement speed. Uh, an attack speed increased by 15% for 15 seconds. So make sure to think of what your party setup you will be using. Number three, your animal and geo statues of the sevens. When you level the animals and geo statues of the sevens, um, they will increase your stamina. Once you start the game, you will have a hundred stamina. But when you increase both of those, uh, both of those statues of the seven to level ten, you will be able to have 240 stamina. Which, as you can see, my bar is much bigger than you know what you start when you start with the game. So how do you upgrade these statues of the sevens? What you have to do is c collect anim animoculuses and geoculuses around uh, Mondstadt and Liyue, and then return them to the statue of the seven. Number four, your element of choice. Your element of choice does really matter in certain areas, such as uh, Mondstadt, Liyue, um, Fontaine, Sumeria, and Inazuma, because most of these will have their elements constructs in that area. What I mean is that Mondstadt would have lots of a animal constructs, which you need to have animal characters, and, and that applies to every other area. Because at because uh, once you start exploring, you will start to notice that um, lot, you will need lots of different elements uh, in different areas that you need to be using. And also remember um, remember to also use your characters that also you could be using two two high like two exploration characters like Lynette and Sayu and what I have here. Is Kazu and Farina because they could deal they can do a lot of damage on the side because lots of chests are um, are are protected by enemies I would also like to remind you guys if you really like these guides that I've been uploading please like and subscribe It'll, it helps my channel a lot and um, if any of these tips helped you to gain your exploration to increase your exploration progress, uh, watch some of my other videos. They can help. They can also help. What? What else? Whatever you need. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.